I am Director of Trade and Consumer Affairs, Mrs. Carrier Christopher, and I am pleased to introduce to you the winner of November's Business of the Month. Hi, I'm Tony Simpson of Soleil Spa, and we are November Business of the Month. Soleil Spa is the November Business of the Month as the Department of Trade and Consumer Affairs continues its efforts to promote and assist small businesses in the territory. Owned and operated by Miss Tony Simpson, Soleil Spa was established in 1995. Over the years, Miss Simpson and her dedicated team developed and maintained a standard of excellence in offering classic and exclusive treatments and products. As a result, Sole Spa has been featured in the Virgin Islands Property and Yacht magazine and has received a number of other awards. Sole Spa incorporates the blessings of nature's little secrets in its innovative and often original treatment options. Sole Spa was established in 1995, so the business has been here for 20 years and we believe we are one of the oldest spas in the territory. We are currently located upstairs in the Mill Mall above Best of British and BNF Medical Complex. And we house four well-appointed treatment rooms. We have a separate manicure and pedicure area. We have a relaxation lounge for people to sit and have a cup of coffee or tea before or after their treatments. We encourage that because we want them to keep the relaxation with them after their treatment. Um, we have a full spa boutique, which we are standing in at the moment. We sell skin care, body care, so that for whatever treatment they've had, they can take something home to continue. Um, we sell gift certificates and gift items such as aromatherapy, candles. We also do out calls to villas and mega yachts. Clients are treated to a variety of pleasurable and healing treatments in the tranquil atmosphere of Soleil Spa. What we do at Soleil Spa are massages, facials, uh, body scrubs, body wraps. We do body contouring. We do waxing, uh, reflexology, manicures, pedicures, gel nails. So we are a full, well-appointed spa. In addition to providing impeccable quality in their services and products, Soleil Spa has made generous contributions to the wider society, including Visar, Rotaract, the H. Lavity Stout Community College, as well as local primary and secondary schools. We give back um, in many ways. We give back monetarily. We give back in the way of gift donations. We give um, product to local organizations and we give our time and service to the community. Mm -hmm. We've given to the Cancer Society, uh, donating to the free mammogram program, to uh, the Family Support Network, the Humane Society, lots of schools and churches in the community. We give to Visar. Um, we've recently been asked by the Cricket Society to donate um, manicures because they have just kicked off a women's cricket league. Um, and we even gave towards, um, we gave a monetary donation towards the purchase of a pair of eyeglasses for a young lady. In describing how they heard about the Business of the Month initiative, Ms. Simpson shares more on the next step for the operations. As, trade, as the trade building is just behind us, I drive by each morning and I've seen their sandwich board outside advertising. But I think somebody um, recommended us because I received an email with the application. I filled it out, sent it in, and here we are. Her advice for prospective business owners? Utilize the wealth of knowledge that is available to you at the Trade and Consumer Affairs Department. If you need assistance writing a small business plan, they can offer that to you. Don't be afraid to go and pick up the application, read through what the requirements are, and start to compile all of that. It's, it's actually a fun um, process to go through, and they're very helpful over there. They're not scary people. They, they will help you through the process, and they will um, give you great guidance. Um, they're ready to do anything that you need. If you have a passion that you would like to turn into profit, make sure that you get your education behind that. If you 
don't have um, business management, take advantage of the courses at the college. Take a business management course. Take an accounting course. Make sure that you have what you need behind you to propel you forward in business. Don't be afraid to work hard and don't be afraid of your failures. Your failures will only propel you into your strengths and success. Most importantly, um, build yourself a strong work ethic and a strong business ethic and live by that. We have loyal clients who have been coming to Soleil Spa for the last 20 years and we believe that the reason they continue to come back is that we offer them impeccable customer service and client care and when they leave here they're feeling better than they walked through the door and they're anticipating coming back for their next treatment. Spearheaded by the Trade and Consumer Affairs Department, the Business of the Month initiative is part of the department's strategy to fuel the entrepreneurial spirit among local small businesses, encourage friendly competition, and promote extraordinary customer service. The Business of the Month initiative is designed to highlight and assist small businesses in the BVI and is a part of the overall local investment strategy of the Trade and Consumer Affairs Department. Winners receive a check of $1,500, free advertisements for one month, a business profile on the government's website and in the online media, a featured article in our local newspapers, a profile on the BVI CCHA website, one year's free membership with the BVI CCHA, and a framed certificate as the featured business of the month. Through the business of the month program, a local business will be featured and showcased every month. At the end of the year, one of the featured businesses will be nominated for Small Business of the Year. We invite you, the public, to nominate the next Business of the Month. Nomination forms are available online at bvi.gov.vg and must be submitted to the Department of Trade and Consumer Affairs in the Sebastian Building. Alternatively, submissions may be emailed to bvitrade at gov.vg